Today we are going to be prompting the player to add a certain game into their Roblox favorites. As you can see here, do you want to add main tutorial place to favorites? Yes or no? I'm going to do yes and this will be added to my Roblox favorites. In order to go ahead and get started with prompting our player to favorite our game, we need to go right over here to starter player and then inside of starter character scripts we're going to click on the plus icon and insert a local script. The reason why we're doing starter character scripts is because we want this local script to start running as soon as the character joins the game. So this local script let's go ahead and click on and we can rename this to prompt favorite just like this. And now we have our prompt favorite script. Let's go right over here inside of our code. And we're going to start off by going ahead and getting something called avatar editor service. And this is going to be equal to game get service avatar editor service. Now avatar editor service, as you're about to see, is used for editing the player's avatar but not only that, but also creating outfits and saving outfits and stuff like that inside of a game for the player. It's mainly used for those like dress up games or you can create your own outfits or whatever. But we're going to be using it to set a favorite of a game here. So we're going to say avatar editor service colon prompt set favorite. Now this is typically used for assets and bundles on the catalog, but we're going to be kind of exploiting that and using it for our games instead. Now this item ID, instead of giving an actual item ID of something that's on the catalog, we're going to give the place ID of our game. And to get that place ID, you want to go over to this view tab right over here on the top. And then we want to go all the way over here to this button called the Asset Manager. We want to click on this. And from there, if your game hasn't been saved already, you are going to need to click on Save to Roblox or Save. There should be a little button right here. And you should just be able to give it a name and then click on Save and it'll save your game. Once that's done loading, come back here. And we're going to click on this Places folder right here. Open that up and you'll see that your tutorial place, well, your place, not tutorial place, this is called a main tutorial place because I named it that, but your place will be right here. You just want to right click and press copy ID to clipboard. From there we should have the ID copied, so we can just paste it right over here inside of our script and that will be good to go. From there we want to put a comma right here and we need to give an item type which is an avatar item type, but technically we're just going to be using this for our place. So we don't actually need to give a specific item type. We're just gonna say enum.avataritemtype.asset. And then from there, we just need to give a Boolean value of whether or not the player should favorite or should not favorite. If we do false, then I believe it will unfavorite the game. However, if we do true, I believe it will be it will favorite the game. We wanna make sure we do true, so that way the player will actually go ahead and favorite the game. And that should be all that I believe we all have to do. So let me zoom out here so you guys can get the whole script right here. It really isn't all too much. Now that you have it, let's go click on this home button right over here and let's click play. So join our game. You'll see that do you want to add main tutorial place to favorites? And I have the option to do yes or no. If I do yes, You'll see that the window closes and over here on my Roblox profile, let's scroll down to the favorites and you can see that the main tutorial place is now among my favorites and you'll see that it is favorited. So as you can see, that worked absolutely perfectly. But anyways, I think that's going to be where I end today's tutorial. If you enjoyed it and learned from it, please make sure you like, subscribe and comment down below. I hope you have an absolutely fantastic rest of your day and I'll see you in the next tutorial. Bye.